Worse than any other country on earth, the United States has hundreds of thousands of nonviolent drug offenders living behind bars. When you look at two million people in prisons and jails across the nation, about 60% are in there for drugs or drug-related crime. In California, as in most other states, incarceration is big business with big profits. They trade their stock on Wall Street based upon the number of people that are in jail. If that isn't sick, if that isn't the best definition of sickness in a society, in a culture, in a civilization, I can't tell you what is. If you believe sick people deserve treatment instead of jail time, then please, on November 4th, vote yes on Proposition 5. Because sick people need compassion, not prison. The judge ordered me to go to treatment, and I'm not able to go to treatment, so this is what I'm getting instead, chain gang and county jail. The massive private prison corporations and well-funded prison guard unions want you to believe that Prop 5 gives criminals a free get-out-of-jail card by categorizing nonviolent drug offenders with hardened criminals. Does a man who gets caught growing a pot plant deserve to be locked in the same cell with a man who raped and murdered someone? Conviction rate is almost 100%. And people that are doing the longest time here are the ones that had a strategy, that went to court, and fought it, and lost. So vote yes on Proposition 5 and help sick people turn their lives around while saving the taxpayers of California over two and a half billion dollars per year. So even if you don't live in California, please pass this on to anyone who does.